This whole idea for Mudwalk came about when I was uh, working as a research scientist for a small startup in Boston. Uh, and we were developing these underwater power systems to power sensors at the bottom of the ocean uh, using ocean sediment as the fuel. Um, and it was a super cool project, but during that time, I would go around to all these educational events and show kids little buckets of dirt, lighting little lights, and they would flip out and get really excited and confused, but really curious as well. Yeah, so I, I called up my best friend from elementary school, Kevin, um, who happened to be a, while. a brilliant engineer and product designer. Um, and together we made the, uh, the first pass at the mud watt. Yeah, and uh, yeah, I remember to me it was really exciting because, you know, as a kid, I, it's something, it's an experience I can relate to in the sense that I was never very good at memorizing information and just sort of soaking in knowledge from textbooks. And so for me, the idea to have this kit that could really connect you with the natural world and sort of draw on those concepts that you're learning in class made a lot of sense. So there was this uh, eighth grader in California named Ricky. He was one of our first customers. Um, and what he did was he uh, really dug in to the, the science of the kit and he went and tried to find the stinkiest mud he could find, uh, which happened to be in one of his uh, local rivers. And so he and his father went out to the river and dig, uh, like dug up some of this mud uh, put it in the mud watt, and it actually produced double the power that Kevin and I had ever produced with the mud watt. Um, and he reported this information back to us, and we had this really great conversation. And so it was just a great experience because uh, Ricky got super engaged. He learned a ton about the science behind the mud watt, but also his local area. Um, and we learned about the technology uh, and. The, the father and the son had this great bonding experience together. As an engineer, I, I'm constantly striving to, to achieve what already exists. Um, th you know, the, the things that we create are always based on something that's already been done and done much better in nature. Um, so I think for that reason, it's a really great source of inspiration for kids. Um, but I think it also encourages curiosity, um, partly because I mean, you can't actually see with your eyes what's happening inside the kit. And it forces you to wonder what else might exist, what else is happening in the air around you and your water. Um, how does that make you think about designing a new system or a new product or something to impact a person's health? Um, I think these are huge opportunities and we're just scratching the surface with the Mudbot. One of our goals of, of the kit is not only to get kids to become scientists and engineers, but become scientists and engineers that have a natural empathy towards natural systems and, and the earth and the complexity and the beauty that goes along with it. Um, I think the, the combination of technical knowledge and skill plus empathy will, will really change the world.